and they're biking to save lives. That's the goal of today's Tour for Hope. And many of these bikers have in one way or another been touched by suicide. They hope this race spreads awareness for their cause. KTV News Watch 7's Lauren Scott is live this morning. Good morning, Lauren. Good morning, James and Chen. Today's race benefits the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, and it also serves as a a beacon of hope for many of the people here who have been touched by suicide. And right now, I have the co-chair of the local chapter here with me right now, Eileen Brady. Eileen, how are you doing today? Doing great. Thank you for being here. Yes, of course. And so why do you think events like this are so important? It's important that we raise awareness in our community. Suicide is preventable, and we want people in the community to know that there's help and there's hope and that there's resources available. We, we do not want anyone to feel like they're alone. And so uh, how long are you guys going to be out here today? Oh, we're going to be out here. It's going to, the sun's going to come out. It's going to be a beautiful day. We've got three routes going, a 12 mile, a, a 25 mile, and a 42 mile. And we'll be out till the last rider comes in. We're having lunch uh, for all the riders and just going to have a good time. And people can still sign up, right? Absolutely. We can come out and register and offer a donation if you would so choose. But yes, we still accept registration here today. All right. So they just had the first group take off. But like you heard Aline say, they have uh, registration is still open if you want to come on out or just come on out and cheer people on. It's a great time and a great cause. For now, reporting live, Lauren Scott, KGTV News Watch 7. There's help and there's hope. Good message. Thank you, Lauren.